Alexander, and I got this book, All My Stripes. Yeah, there you go, Alexander. Go ahead and read it. And, 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 uh, we, um, I'm going to be, um, watched it on, um, on YouTube or something. We watched it on YouTube. Yeah, we watched it. Okay. What's a treat? All My Stripes. A story for children with autism. A story for children with autism. I'm one, too. I have autism too. Yes, you do have autism. Mm. For all my stripes. All my stripes. All my stripes. A story for children with autism. Zena, Zane ran home. Zane ran home as fast as he could. Nobody gets me, Mama. Mama hugged Zane. He began to tell her about his bad day. This morning in our class, the teacher started a hoof, a hoof painting project. I didn't want to give paint on my hoof, so the Teacher gave me a paintbrush. Paintbrush. All the other zebras noticed me and were making fun of me because they didn't understand why I wouldn't use my hoofs. That's not very nice. Mm -mm. Mama said, I bet that made you feel different from the rest of the group. Mm -hmm. Jane replied, I didn't, but I did, but paint is just too weird to touch. During math class, during math class, the fire alarm blared loudly. While the children in my class were getting in line quietly, I hid under my, the desk screaming and covering my ears. Class left without me, and it, I was scared until the firefighters found me. When the class, when the class came back from lunch, everyone was putting their lunch boxes in their cubbies. Hello, classmates. We're talking about a video game. I play all the time, but I didn't know how to start talking to them. Very good, looks good. I started talking about all the things I knew about the game, but since I was starting at the floor, nobody knew I was talking to them. When the other kids walked away, I started talking louder. I really wanted them to hear me, but everyone, everybody was getting ready for science class. <laughs> Pretty funny, huh? Yeah. Go with that. We sat down for science and we learned about the planets. Our teacher gave us a planner to draw, but I wanted to create my own. When it came to to when it came when it came time for present mom to present I felt present I felt different from Mama, the rest of when it came time to present my teacher looked my I felt different from the rest of the class again. My teacher looked my plane and I said, Whatever floats your boat. I spent I spent the rest of the afternoon looking for a boat in the classroom. 
That was supposed to be a joke, right? Yeah. yeah. That's kind of a joke, hon. Mm -hmm. What? What they just said. Oh. Whatever floats your boat, it's like a phrase or something. Oh, yeah, okay. But people with autism sometimes don't understand jokes. Okay. Yeah. He was crying. How come all anyone sees is my autism strength? Mama carried Zane over to the mirror. Mama cried, carried Zane over to the mirror. When I look at you, I see many different stripes. If one of them were missing, you wouldn't be the same. Look at that. <laughs> That's silly, huh? That's funny. Mm -hmm. I see your pilot stripe. When we get lost in the city, you will always remember the way home. Nice pictures? Mm hmm. Pretty nice pictures. <coughs> your carrying stripe makes. You act kindly toward others. When your classmates think it's funny to bully other kids, you come to the rescue. And it looks like that you're playing soccer. Mm -hmm. <gasps> I'm honest too! <laughs> yeah, you're on the two, yeah. Your honesty strike lets me always trust your word when other parents have to worry that their kids aren't telling the truth. I know you're always. You always are telling the truth. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I can tell when you're not, though. My favorite. My favorite stripe is your curiosity stripe. Curiosity. Curio curiosity. That's a big word. Curiosity stripe. When all the other kids are falling asleep in the class, in the class, you know, uh, you always want to know more. I love when you come home and tell me everything you learned. I love when you come home happy too, Alexandra. So you didn't come home happy. Yeah. Yeah, but it was a tough day for you. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you ask me questions, and I don't even know the answers. Mm-hmm. Sometimes I don't even know them. Huh? Mama? Mama pointed out the rest of Zane's amazing stripes. Mm -hmm. The more stripes he displayed, the better Zane began to feel about himself. By the time she was finished, Zane loved feel about himself. Zane became to feel about himself. By the time she was finished, Zane mm -hmm. loved himself again. Harry's happy again. Zane ran outside feeling the warmth of the of the of the of sun. the sun. Ooh, that always feels good. Finally he felt proud of all his stripes. Yay. He said, there's more to me than just my autism stripe. It's just part, it's just a part of, it's just part of me. The other parts make the whole me. I love each stripe because without them, I wanted to be me. Exactly, Alexander. If you were different, you know. Mm -hmm. There, the end. Very good. Very good reading, Alexandra. Mm -hmm. Story with <laughs> no, children for all And there we go! All My Stripes, a book no. I recommend, right? No, Alexandra, would you recommend that book? Mm -hmm. You just found out this week you had autism. No, and so we're trying to introduce okay, good books turn. to read that aren't overwhelming. Now, Isabella's turn to read. What is she going to pick? Oh, Isabella! Oh. I can't even read it. No, I she can't, can't read it yet, but she can look at pictures. Yeah. She picked that one out. Fancy Nancy. <gasps> What's Fancy Nancy doing? Uh oh. Are you going to need your sister to help read? No. <sighs> oh, no. no. 
Abby. You can do it? Was okay, we'll just sit and watch it, Alexandra. Very good. Isabella! <laughs> and there was going to be. It's about you just show pictures, okay? You just show it looks pictures. like her bedroom, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, look at She's got books in her bedroom, a mirror, a dresser. <gasps> Ooh, that's what's like a page. nice dresser. Y'all turn the page. I'll turn the page. Okay, okay. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa. I know it's, it says, I love being fancy. Ooh, look at that room. Wow, that's a fancy room, isn't it? You guys want a princess bed. Yeah. It sort of looks like Turn one. the page. Here. Want me to read it? No. No, just look at pictures. Oh, guess what color she likes? The fancy way of saying purple is fuchsia. That's her favorite color. Whose favorite color is that? Me. Yours too. Oh, who's a fancy girl? Uh-oh, she is. Oh. A princess is supposed to wear what? Crown. A tiara. Tiara. On her head, yes. Lace trim socks she has. Whoa. <laughs> oh, looks like she brought sandwiches to daddy. <laughs> oh, there she is. It looks like. The supermarket. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Stupendous is a Isabella. big word. In the refrigerator, there's a big sign on it. Lean to be fancy with lessons from Nancy. Start today, easy, fun, and free. Yay! Things that are free are cool. Mm -hmm. This book yeah. is from the library. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Ooh, soon there's a knock at the door. My family saw an ad. They want to get started right away. Okay. They're ready. So now turn the page. It's a bus. Skip one. Page. That's okay. We'll help her. Oh my goodness. Magic for kids? <laughs> oh, the <laughs> trouble is my family. Yeah. Yeah, it's a lot of accessories. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And clothes. It's a lot. Wow. <gasps> Ooh, look at their dad and mommy are getting all fancy too. When they play it all together, isn't that nice? Oh. <laughs> They're going outside like that? Oh, oh that people would think they're silly. Mm -hmm. Oh, there they go. <laughs> when we arrive, look at the people's faces. What on earth? They're probably saying. Mm -hmm. They're gawking He's and they're proud. like, what? I'll do it. Yep, it's a true story. And then they're eating together as a family, enjoying themselves. Yep. Darling. Darling. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. That's a word for something. <laughs> Amazing. My mother knows French. Whoa. Yes. Just like this kid, Peggy and Muppet Babies. Yeah. Uh huh. Just like her. But she likes this more for like. Uh oh. Like what's that? Uh oh. Fancy waiter. Oops, I trip and slip and uh oh, what happens? Oh no, look what happened to all the ice cream things. The tree does a double flip. Now everybody's staring at him again. Uh, it's about, it's about. Oh, I bet you she feels really bad right now. Huh? Mm -hmm. I bet you she, no, no, other page. Here. Oh, she doesn't feel fancy anymore. She wants to go home. Oh. Abs accidents happen though, don't they, guys? Mm -hmm. After all the cleanup, they get they're getting ready for bed, aren't they? Mm -hmm. They tell she tells her parents. Wow, she has ice cream. Yep, at home. She tells her parents for thank you for being fancy tonight. Yay! Mm -hmm. No, amen. No, not amen. <laughs> not the end either yet. Was it? All in this. I said. Mom says I love you. Dad says I love you. And. I say back to him, I love you, too. Now it's the end. Yeah. Yep. Good reading, girls. <laughs>